Nothing good about what our government is doing for the welfare of its people. 1. Was glad to see the Center for Science in the Public Interest, Washington, D.C. Criticize them for there is only a minority that realize and can understand the problem. If there is one thing you have to realize when you do research is that the Neanderthals are in the majority or the world would not be in the state it is and I am afraid they are running this country. Those thanatomaniac beings are running for a fallen children. The key to life is to stay the devil, and I do mean devil, away and take care of yourself. 70% or more of our foods have sugar in everything from bubby food to beer, tonsillitis, colds, flu, in children as well as adults all have sugar in part as our basis as it robs the body of vitamin C, B complex and all its nutrients in an attempt to digest what sugar hasn't in the vein. Attempt. A good whole food is one that digests itself and requires no other added agents clean from the body. It is a plus food, not a minus. Refined food all contributes to a poor germplasm and offspring with very poor hormonal stability through the generations and thus the androgynous being enters. But let us return to the androgynous people of another time into one of the results of androgynous women. And one of the most misunderstood tales of religion, the virgin birth. 8. 16. The androgyne. References. 1. The virgin birth, the famous debate between Herbert M. Shelton, N.D., D.C., and Judge R. Clements, N.D., D.C., Health. Research, Mokilum Hill, California, 1957. 2. Science, May 25, 1984. 3. Textbook of Endocrinology, 5th edition, edited by Robert H. Williams, M.D., with contributions by 38. Authorities, W.B. Saunders Company, Philadelphia, 1974. 4. The Geomagnetic Field in Life, Geomagnet Biology. A. P. Dubrov, Plenum Press, New York, N.Y., 1978. 5. The Apocrypha and Pseudepigrapha of the Old Testament, R. H. Charles, Oxford, 1913. 6. The Rigveda, an anthology, edited by Wendy Doni Shero Flaherty. Penkin Classics, New York, NY, 1984. 7. The Developing Human, Second Edition, Clinically Oriented. Embryology, Keith.